screaming, the whole camp is awake. Whoa! Easy there, kiddo. Woo! The entire campus is already here. You guys better scram, daytime buzz kills. Whoa! Don't wreck our nighttime party. Oh, really? Daytime buzz kills? Darling, calm down. <sighs> Hey! What's, What's the, the deal? deal? You decided to crash my party? Yep. Let's, let's go! 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 I ain't going anywhere. All right, enough with the bickering. Why did you come here to hassle us? Because all the normal folks are sleeping now, and so should we. Cassie, come on. Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Fine, hit the road, losers. I'll get back at them for ruining the fun. How are we supposed to party now without music? Oh. Ah. Ah. oh, we won't let him sleep anyway. <laughs> Good morning, classmates. Get enough sleep? Get lost, party pooper. Nope, no sleep for you guys. Time to start a brand new day. We're wiped out. We partied all night. Gonna have to perk you up. Hot cocoa for everyone. <gasps> Hooray! <laughs> yes. Oh, give me one. Oh. That's actually helping a lot. Now let's get moving. 10 jumps on the jump rope. And you won't be sleepy anymore. <laughs> I'm not sleepy. <laughs> the rest of you follow my lead. <laughs> Why are these day folks here? Hey, they woke up the whole gang. Ugh, and me too. They need to scram. Why are Tina and Zach snoozing? It's their fault everyone's groggy. All right, rise and shine. Get up and do your exercises. Ugh, you people are crazy. Who made you the boss around here? Because it's daytime now, duh. And this is our time, you dimwit. You'll pay for calling me a dimwit. Hands off, Cassie. Ah, get lost! Idiot! If you touch Tina again, I'll snap those sunshine rays real quick! Let's go! There you go, we've ditched the nighttime slackers! <laughs> Let's keep the exercise going! One, two, with these day people is impossible! Totally! They don't sleep and won't let anyone! They mess up our sleep schedules! They're always embarrassing us in front of the whole class! Yeah, we need to show them who's boss at school! By the way, thanks for having my back. Of course, you're my favorite night owl. <laughs> <laughs> but seriously, Casey's way too sassy. It's because Nate is always taking her side. Don't worry, we'll put them in their place. Definitely. We need to figure out... <sighs> wow. This book has some powerful spells in it. Amazing! Check this out. A spell to change day into night? <laughs> cool! Oh my god, I know what to do. Tina, what's your plan already? No time to explain, I'm in a hurry. Tina, you're freaking me out. Hey, Ariel, come over with Kitty to the attic today. I need your help. Wait! I uh, hope she won't do anything crazy. Come on in. Tina, did you call us to do some magic again? <laughs> you bet. You're my devoted fans, my night priestesses. <laughs> <laughs> I'm all about magic. Let's get started. So, what's the plan for today? Casey and Nate have seriously ticked me off. They think daytime is better than nighttime. Seriously? seriously? Want to teach them a lesson? <laughs> yeah. I found this super cool ritual. <laughs> I can't wait! What's the ritual? Casey adores her precious Nate and thinks he'll always be by her side. So I'll just turn Nate into nighttime. <laughs> what? Let's see how she reacts when he becomes a completely different Nate from the one she liked. 
what if it's risky? Forget about it. They always ruin our parties and think they can control campus. As long as no one gets hurt. Oh, let's do it. Day turns into night. White goes to black. I'm getting a little scared! Enough! Keep reading. Let me wake, wake up, up all gloomy and doomed! <gasps> ah! It worked! Now let's head off to sleep. Okay. <sighs> Nate? What happened to him? Why is Zach making such a fuss? It's already morning. <sighs> Nate, what's going on with you? <sighs> Zach, can you not shut so early in the morning? Like, why aren't you sleeping? <sighs> Cassie, I've turned into the night. What do we do now? I turned into day. Ugh. This is clearly some mix-up. Don't freak out. We'll figure it out. Uh. How did this happen? I wanted to transform Nate. Why did Zach transform instead? Darn. It's my birthday today. How am I going to face my friends? Uh, don't worry. It's just a regular illness. Uh, Tina, did you accidentally do this with your magic trick? Uh, uh, seriously? How could you even think that? Uh, I'm sorry, <laughs> Tina! Darn! What do we do now? Cassie, I honestly didn't do anything. It happened on its own. I'll get to the bottom of this, my love. Ouch! You burned me! Sorry, I'm not used to you being the knight now. I'll find out who's behind this. Watch where you're going. Why are you guys so grumpy? We're night priestesses, and it's daytime now. <sighs> we want to sleep. These night fanatics, I swear. Are you OK? Maybe you want some sunny candies? Wow. Daytime folks are the friendliest. Where's Nate? He's not feeling well. What are they talking about over there? Nate didn't show up at school? He probably got spooked by his new look. I told Tina this could be risky. I hope everything's fine. The main thing is, nobody finds out she's to blame. To blame? So Tina orchestrated this? I'll confront her right now. She'll spill the whole truth. Well, hello there. Anything you want to spill? <laughs> no! Uh, no, nothing happened, seriously. Quit lying. I heard your chat with your buddies. What did you do to Nate? <laughs> Enough! <laughs> What's Zach got to do with this? I'm talking about Nate. He's turned into the night. <laughs> Zach turned into day. What? They swapped? <laughs> Casey... I'm sorry, I performed a ritual, and when we had a fight, I decided to get back at Nate and turn him into night. Are you <laughs> kidding me? You <laughs> wanted to make my boyfriend a night creature? <laughs> well, yeah, you guys were getting on my nerves. What about Zach? I would never have cast a spell on him, but for some reason, he also turned. <laughs> That's it, I've had enough. You have to reverse everything. But how? I don't know. Do whatever you want. But Nate must go back to normal. Otherwise, I'll spill the beans to Zach that it's your doing. No, uh, please. I told him it's an illness. Then find the solution to the problem faster. Goodbye. Hey, Zach. Feeling any better? No. This isn't some ordinary illness. What if I'm stuck like this forever? Come on. Whoa, watch out! You're gonna burn something. Uh, see, I can't control this power of mine. <sighs> Have some tea, it'll help. No, Tina, I've turned into daylight. This isn't a regular cold. Ah, ah, I accidentally beamed myself in the eyes. Ah. Knock it off. It's your birthday today. I'm not celebrating. The day's ruined. 
Yes, you are. Hey! Wrap yourself up! <sighs> Will this go away soon? Soon. Just focus on getting better and stay in your room. Uh, uh, oh, turn it off! The light is killing my eyes! I'm really sorry. You're so cold. Sure thing. I'm a creature of the night now. I found out everything. It's Tina's fault. What? She did some ritual to turn you into a knight. Uh, seriously? Well, I'm gonna have a word with Hold her. Hold on. We struck a deal with her that she'll fix everything herself. And what if she doesn't? Trust me, she will. Her favorite Zack suffered too. <laughs> this is getting interesting. She messed up something and he's daytime now too. She'll definitely set things right. <laughs> <laughs> Just don't spill the beans to Zack. He thinks he's come down with something. What a load of nonsense. Poor guy, it's his birthday today. <laughs> <laughs> It is a day, not a night. We threw a party for you. Yeah, I already said cool, just incredibly cool. Now it's time to blow out the candles. What a weird cake, totally not my style. <sighs> All right, I just want to get better. <gasps> What's this? He decided to snooze at his own birthday bash? This won't cut it. We gotta wake him up. Lame party. Yeah, Zach slept through his entire birthday. Oh, well, just hang on. Maybe he'll wake up soon. How much longer can we wait? Hey, wakey, wakey. Uh, um, uh, yes. <coughs> it's clear he doesn't care about us. <gasps> oh, me? I don't care. Oh! Ah! It's supposed to be a nighttime party. Are you like 40 or something? All right, I'm done. Zach is not the guy he used to be. Yeah, it's no fun hanging out with him. Well, no, uh, please wait. What's going on, Zach? Why did you ruin the party? Tina, <sighs> give it a rest. I'm sleeping. <sighs> Nate, come on, wake up. You were always so happy in the morning. Mm. Yeah, that was when I was Mr. Daytime. Now I'm Mr. Nighttime. I don't need my beauty sleep in the morning. <sighs> Repeat after me. You'll wake up in a jiffy. Oh, um. Nate, what's the matter? Uh, my head's spinning. I'm practically sleepwalking. <sighs> Have some water. It'll snap you out of it. I'll go for my morning jog. That should shake off the cobwebs. You're such a trooper. We need to remind Tina about her promise. I can't stand seeing you struggle like this. Nate! Huh? Uh, sorry. <sighs> yeah, I can't wait for this to be over. But don't worry, I'll handle it. <gasps> Darn. I don't even recognize him. This ain't my Nate. Good morning! Get up, it's time for school! Seriously? It's morning, I wanna sleep. Mornings are fantastic! I adore mornings. <laughs> You're annoying. You act like a parrot. Hey, I'm not a parrot. You totally embarrassed me yesterday. You overslept for your own party. So what? I'm not feeling well. I just wanted some sleep. You're not sick at all, you're just faking it. Go to your classes. You're acting weird. One minute you're saying stay at home, the next off to school. You ruined the party, now I'm mad. Fine, I can see you're not in a good mood. We'll talk later. How do you even cancel this ritual? This book has nothing. I know. I'll contact the queen of the sky herself and ask her how to fix everything. Why'd you invite us this time? I need to set things right. You don't want Nate to be night? 
I don't want Zack to be Day. He's suffering too. We need to find out why Zack changed too. That's why we need to reach out to the Queen of the Sky. We'll ask her directly. <laughs> you said she hates being bothered. We don't have a choice. Remember the chant? Mm-hmm. We summon the, the Queen, queen of, of the Sky. sky. I told you not to bother me with trivial stuff. I'm sorry, but I've got a major problem. I performed this complex ritual and now I want to undo everything. What kind of ritual? Swap day and night. Have you lost your mind? Those rituals are irreversible. What? what? You should have thought twice before messing with such powerful magic. But I only transformed one guy, and my boyfriend, Zack, he got transformed too. Did you really think it would be that easy? There has to be balance in the universe. If someone becomes night, someone else becomes day. So how can I fix everything now? You can't. Live with it now. And don't call me again. No. <gasps> how could I mess this up so bad? Okay, <sighs> stop crying. We'll come up with something. Casey's gonna kill me, and she'll spill everything to Zack. Zack is gonna kill me! Everything will work out! No, it won't! I need to tell Casey the truth! Hey, Tina! Where are you going? Casey, we need to talk. You promised to set things right, or should I go talk to Zack? Well, that's what I wanted to say. I reached out to the Queen of the Sky. What? Did she respond? And why are you crying? This sounds really bad. I'm sorry. The ritual is irreversible. <laughs> what? How could you? You've ruined my life. You messed up Nate's life too. Cassie, knock it off. Oh. Ah, it's too hot. Ah. You've ruined my relationship for your own benefit. Casey, I told you I feel ashamed. What was that all about? A lunar eclipse. You're acting foolish. I hope you'll stop being so selfish someday. Oh, oh no, they'll never forgive me. And Zack still doesn't know the truth. <laughs> Nate, what's going on here? Uh, I don't know. I'm drawing symbols. What kind of symbols? Uh, I don't even understand it. They just pop into my head, appear in my dreams, and I see them everywhere. Nate, you sound like you've gone crazy. Uh, no, it's the power of night. I can do fortune telling now. Have you completely lost it? Do you even know that Tina messed everything up and you won't be able to be the daylight anymore? I don't care. I'm enlightened now. I see the future! Nate, you're not yourself at all. Where's the Nate who used to have party breakfast and jog with me in the mornings? Stop bothering me! You're not the same guy. You're not my boyfriend anymore. I've had enough. I'm going to spill the beans to Zack. Oh. Man, my temperature's at 40 again. What's going on? Ugh. Chill. You're daytime. That's our normal temperature. What are you doing here? To spill the beans. Your Tina's responsible for this. What? What's Tina got to do with it? Tina performed a ritual to turn Nate into a night creature, and you got caught in the mix, and you turned into the day. What? So Tina caused all this? I'm not sick? It's not an illness, buddy. You've just turned into the daytime. Unbelievable. How could she? She even played you for a fool. The ritual is irreversible, no turning back. No! I'll never be night again! All right, I'm gonna go have a word with Tina. Poor guy. He didn't deserve this. Tina! Uh, are you sick or what? I can't stand daylight. We need to talk like right now. Hold up! Calm down, I told you to stay home and recover! Why'd you come to school? Tina, you can't make up your mind, you told me to go to school yourself! And Cassie spilled the beans, you're a liar! Oh no! What did she tell you? 
about the ritual and that it's not an illness at all. Now I'm stuck in daytime forever. Zack, I didn't mean for this to happen. I thought only Nate would turn into a night creature. You should have thought before taking action. You've messed up the lives of a bunch of people. Zack, I'm sorry. No, Tina. I don't want to talk to you. We're done. I can't handle this anymore. Zack, no! I know that's what I was talking about. Look. What have I done? <laughs> Tina, calm down. Cassie, hey, you see me or what? Oh, hi. Sorry, I'm just beat. Cassie, nights are awesome, you know? I'm into astronomy. Oh, really? That's interesting. Hmm, she's totally ignoring me. Have I become a nobody to her? Cassie, I'll be back soon. I get it. Maybe she's done with me. <laughs> Tina? <laughs> What's going on? Zack dumped me. He found out I turned him into a daytime guy and got mad. <laughs> Dang, that's rough. Uh, by the way, I know you turned me too. I'm sorry. It was a dumb prank. I thought I'd joke around and then change it back. <laughs> it's cool. Drop it. Uh, Cassie doesn't want to be with me either. I kind of dig being a knight. Seriously? Yeah, I'm getting into magic, astrology, and all sorts of stuff. I've even unlocked my third eye. Uh, no way. <laughs> Do you actually have visions? All the time. I can even see the future. Whoa. You're the first guy I've met who's into all of this. Can you read tarot cards? Uh, I'm learning. Um, How about we check when Tyler's going to make a move on Ariel? Let's do it. How are you holding up? Not great. Tina and I called it quits. Whoa. Was it because she turned you into a daytime guy? Yeah. Now I can eat breakfast all day long. Plus, I'm always shining. All right, calm down. Being in the daytime isn't so bad. You don't have to stick to breakfast only. You just need to eat right to keep your energy up. I can't control it. Is this hot chocolate? Oops. My bad. <laughs> You'll get the hang of it soon. We can go for walks and do some sports together. It'll make things easier. You'll see. Sweet. I'm actually starting to enjoy being awake during the day when everyone else is active. Come on, let's get some fresh air. Check out how awesome it is outside and the sun's out. <laughs> nice. I'm feeling way better now. So do you realize everything's okay now? Yeah, I'm back to normal. Daytime is way cooler than nighttime. We've been reading our classmates' tarot cards forever. I'm pooped. Oh, same here. We need some shut eye. How about we throw a nighttime party? Heck yeah, I love parties. Oh, I've never actually been to one, because I used to sleep at night. Wow, you're a real night owl. Maybe turning you wasn't so bad. Oh, exactly. Only you get who I truly am. Cassie, we're so alike. Maybe we should try being a couple. What just happened? Nate, that was so unexpected. Cassie, we're so alike. Maybe we should try being a couple. Why not? <laughs> uh, Tina, I'd love to date you. I want to gaze at the moon every night with you. I'm in. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? What's going on? See, I knew you'd finally make a move on her. <laughs> Looks like I still haven't fully memorized those cards' meaning. Whoa, are you guys dating now? Yep, now I'm dating Knight again. We're the perfect match. I hope Zach and Cassie won't freak out when they find out. Life. Don't hit me on my phone, yeah, I'll get back when I'm posted. They're gonna blackmail cause they see I'm going posted. Hey everyone! Mwah. Seriously? Are you a couple too? Yeah, we realize we're a perfect fit for each other. I can see you and Zach are getting along well. Totally! He's just as much of a day as I am! We're a perfect match! <laughs> Dang, I can't watch them together. 
Do I still have feelings for Zack? <laughs> Nate, you're my superstar! Darn. Why does it bother me that they're together? Zack, you're my love. <laughs> and you're mine. <laughs> <laughs> Ugh, I should invite them to our party. Zack will definitely want a party like the old times, and I can win him back. You know, uh, we're throwing a party tomorrow. We're not interested. You'll keep the whole campus up again. Come on, Zack. We'd love to have you. Are you sure? Absolutely. Cassie, let's go. Seriously, we're supposed to be sleeping at that time. Mm, just a quick visit. I'm already missing the parties. Fine, but just for a little while. Thanks a bunch. We're in. Looks like my plan just might work. Now, your all-time favorite jam! Nighttime party! Whoa! Whoa! I want to sleep. Uh, Cassie, Cassie, what's up? We got a party. Oh, you guys made it. How awesome. <laughs> <laughs> it's the party peak right now. Get in on it. Yeah. Uh, woo! Oh, oh, she's just not used to this. <laughs> Zach, come dance with us. Um, I can't watch this. I still love Tina. Wow! Look at Tina and Nate. They're kissing. Wow! I want that too. Uh, mm, mm, mm. <gasps> A kiss? Enough! Stop it! I don't want to see you guys kissing. What's the matter, you jealous? Yes! Me too! Well, I am annoyed that you and Zack are together! Same here! Nate, I still love you! Oh, too hot! I love you too, Cassie, but we can't be together! I know! Zack, I love you! Tina, I love you too, but our biorhythms don't match. We can't date. Oh, really? Then get out of my party! Well, fine. I'll go! Uh, Cassie, can we talk? You said we can't be together. Bye. <laughs> hey, Cassie. What's wrong? Are you still crying because of the party? Yes. I can't stop loving you just because you're now night. Oh, and I love you. Mm. Nate, if only you could learn to be both day and night at the same time. Maybe that would make things easier. Mm -hmm. huh? What? What's happening? I'm like a knight. But I feel like a day. How is that possible? I don't know. It's because of the sun. With the sun, I gave away my love. And it did some magic. I get it. Now I'm half day, half night. I'm twilight. <laughs> we need to tell Tina and Zack about this. Quickly. I wonder if... Zack will come back to me or not? Oh. Tina, um, hi. Uh, I realized I can't be without you. And me neither. Uh, I want to be with you, even though we're different. We'll figure it out. We'll come up with something. Uh, Tina, I love you. Ouch! It's nothing, really. We just found something out. You both need to know. What happened? We were having a romantic moment here. Look at me! I'm half day, half night! <laughs> I'm Twilight! What? How did you do that? Tina, attach the moon to Zack quickly! Now look! Oh wow! I can feel my nighttime abilities coming back! But I can feel daytime too! But how is this possible? It's some kind of magic. Congratulations, now you're the dawn boy. <laughs> <laughs> now we can be couples. We just need to figure out how this works. Uh, will you come to the party tonight? Woo! Yeah! Yeah! Woo! Yeah! Ah, 
hosting a twilight party. What a cool idea. Totally. I'm not ready to sleep just yet. Twilight is our time now, you and me. We can spend it together. <laughs> <laughs> and our time is at sunrise, right? Well, yeah. You won't even have gone to bed and I'll be wide awake. <laughs> <laughs> it's so awesome we can be together now. And now, let's have a slow dance. This was an unforgettable adventure. We're together because after the day, twilight always arrives. After the dark night, there's always sunrise. And there I am. <laughs> Great, stop rolling! Oh, hey folks, we finally wrapped up the shoot and can chat with our awesome subscribers. Cassie, grab the camera guy and let's take a seat. Uh, uh. Back off, you idiot! Darling, I don't understand. You forgot that today is pink day! Gosh, and you get offended by that? You didn't get me anything! It seems like you don't love me. I love you, I love you. I'm even dressed in pink, see? And how do I check if you really love me? I know, we need a school's couples contest. Well, that's interesting. And to make it interesting, let's also get Tina and Zach. My sweetie, I love you so much. And I love you, you're my joy. <laughs> and my sunshine. No, you're the second couple. Woohoo! Now that was a party! Yes! Dancing <laughs> in abandoned places! Top notch! Woo! Woo! Excellent! And this is the third pair! What? what? We need to test your feelings, and the winner of the competition will get a prize! Wow! This is awesome! Let's see what Nate will do for me. Everyone, get ready! <laughs> this is my chance to get back at the students! <laughs> To do here. I'll tell you everything now. The first contest is for our couples. Let's welcome our guys. Uh, I can't see anything. Uh, well, you're blind. Yikes. Hey, Mrs. Christie, why is only my boyfriend blindfolded? Oh, he's the dumbest one, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> Guess by the waist where his girlfriend is. Then the other guys will do the same. And off we go. Hmm, something strange. Get your hands off, you pig. Nah, this isn't my Cassie. Your waist is too wide. What? How dare you say that? I hate you, idiot. Ow! Oh, I'm sorry! Nick lost! Zach takes the blindfold! Let's go! Uh, I really can't see anything. Let's see. Got it, not her! Hmm. <gasps> Oh, here's my little hey, duck! Well <laughs> I knew you would recognize me! Of course, my most beautiful, most beloved! You're so cute that you even squeak like a rubber duck! Oh, no, 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 no. Woo! Chris, take the blindfold, and the girls will switch places! I'll guess mine on the first try. No. Not her. Darn, I wish I hadn't guessed. Oh, but this one's mine. Stomach <laughs> growling, hasn't had food in a week. <laughs> Even ribs sticking out. All right, you guessed right too. Yay! <laughs> well done, get ready for the next contest. Ugh, I'm fed up. Get away from me already. Darling, forgive me. You didn't recognize me and you call me fat too. Uh, I'm an idiot. I'll do everything for you to forgive me. Go away. Come on, I'm your sweet little kitty. Meow. Why 
is this happening? I just want a normal relationship. Meow. Kiss me. Sure. I'm telling you. <laughs> Eva. <laughs> Eva, look at these weirdos. Gosh, this is cringe. <laughs> Darn it. What's this? Crying to your girlfriend? <laughs> well, actually, I just wanted her to support me. What? What? I mean, I wanted to say that I'm the boss in our relationship, got it? Hmm. So, should we go play basketball during the break then? As if! I'm going to get you now, are you kidding me? Sorry, I'm joking, we're celebrating Pink Day today, I remember everything. Nate, you're such a pushover. I can't. Ay, 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 ay. <laughs> Seriously, they're so dumb. <laughs> <laughs> we're the real cool couple. We'll win this competition. <laughs> love you, my sweetie! And I love you, my favorite little rat! <laughs> uh, Tyler, I think we won't find anything here. Relax, Mrs. Christie left some papers for the contest We've here. We've searched through everything and found nothing! Uh, I don't know, maybe in the library? <sighs> That's it. We won't be able to spoil the couple's contest. <laughs> Wait, I think we can. Look, there's a box. <sighs> Oh, we haven't looked in there yet. There. That's what we need. The list of contests and participants. Zach, Tina, Casey, Nate. Nate. What's wrong? Uh, nothing, nothing. Are we going to change the contests? Yes. We'll arrange something interesting for them. Uh, okay. Listen, maybe we can also participate in the contest together. No, actually, we're not a couple, and the contest is only for couples. Done! Darn it, the teacher's coming, let's hide! <gasps> go, 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 go! So, what's the next challenge for us? Oh, did I come up with this? This is extreme! <laughs> I can imagine them screaming and asking for help instead of a photo shoot for the contest. <laughs> oh, where, are where are we going? going? Oh. Shut up! Stop shouting! Where are we going? I'll tell you! You'll see for yourself soon enough! I'm scared! Fine! I'll allow you to take off the blindfolds! Whoa. What? Jeez, you look scary. I should have stayed blindfolded. And now? Oh, now you look gorgeous. Hey, darling, aren't you afraid? I am scared. I don't even know where they're taking us. My little star, everything's fine. Uh, I brought something for us. Aw, you brought our baby here? Of course, our T Zach. A combination of our names, Tina and Zach. He'll be with you as a talisman. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> well, here's something else. Do you have a princess frog girlfriend? <laughs> Great, so what if I wear this hat? Even with that, you'll still look strange. It won't help. <laughs> <laughs> All, right. All right, we've arrived. I hope Casey and Nate are already here. So here's where your next challenge will take place. Here? Wow, Mrs. Christie, you're really a crazy woman. I'm shocked by myself! We're going to have matchless races! Wow, I've wanted to do this for a long time, and now we can even win the contest! <laughs> well then, boys, get ready, and let's start! The first one to swim to the shore wins! <laughs> Make sure not to embarrass yourself. All right, darling. You must win this contest. Let this talisman be with you. Baby t -Zack will help you. Ah, uh, thanks, honey. I'll do everything for you. <laughs> Listen here, you have to bite your way to victory, got it? Oh. Your punches cheer me up. Really? <laughs> okay, okay, that's enough, that's enough. Are you ready? Yeah! yeah! Great! Go, go, I love you, Zack. You're doing great. Chris, paddles if you're dancing at a party again! Uh, 
I'm sure my idiot will lose again. On your marks! Get set! Go! Where are you swimming, blind? Shut up, I'll get you now! Oh no, what happened there? Your Zack is bothering my Nate! No, that's not true! Why are you saying that, chicken? What did you say? Uh, no! Uh, please, go on! Beat those losers! Woo! I'm the winner of life! Amazing! You're really the coolest! It was all for you, baby. <laughs> Cassie, are you still mad? No, I'm overjoyed. After all, I have such a cool boyfriend. Really? No, of course not. You're the worst person in the Whoa, world. Cassie, uh, stop it. Ah. Uh, looks like they're arguing. Awesome. <laughs> I can see you really like challenges. And we're moving on to the next one. Ooh, I'm ready to win again. Because I'm the king here. Shut up, beggar. Let them announce the task. In this box, your names! What? How did they end up there? Now I want to switch up the couples! This is definitely a test of your relationship strength! Oh no, if someone else is chosen for me, I won't survive this! Uh, me too, I'll be stressed! So, the first pair is... Chris and... Please don't be me! Oh, Chris and Casey! <laughs> this is the best day of my life! <laughs> Ew! Ugh, why him? Wow. I'll have such a beauty with me. <laughs> oh yeah! I'll remember this! Oh? You even washed today! And now, the next pair, Nate and Tina! <laughs> no! I can't! Me neither. You mean everything to me, my beloved. <laughs> Uh, no! <laughs> yeah, we definitely won't win like this. And the last pair, Eva and Sam. Why, I'm scared of her. One more word and I'll spit in your face, got it? Okay, okay, got it. And now, the contest! Now, you have to dance! But uh, I can't dance at all. It doesn't matter. The main thing is to show off your new couple. Let's start. First up, Tina and Nate! Whoa, where did Nate learn that? I didn't get it. Wow, you did really well! Did we pass the challenge? Yes! And now, Zack and Eva will dance! Just so you know, I can't dance at all. All hope is on you. If we lose, then I'll... Uh, I got it. Oh, wow. Eva can dance. Great! You guys handled this task well, too. <laughs> Zach is lucky to survive. Uh -huh. <laughs> Oh, no need for ovation. I know I'm cool. What are we gonna dance? I'll figure it out. Ah! Ah! Let me go! My head is spinning! Ugh. Don't worry. Everything's under control. Ah! <gasps> Jerk! Well done, everyone! Chris and Casey lost. Nate! I hate you! Why? You didn't win with me, but you did with her! That's it, you can stay away from me! Can I fix things with Cassie? Nate, what happened? Nothing new. Everyone at school already knows Cassie's mad at me. That's wonderful! What did you just say? Oops, I, I messed up. I, I meant to say that's awful. Uh, I really love her, but it seems she needs a different guy. <laughs> 
Maybe you'll find a new girlfriend for yourself. Who? Well, a good, caring, kind one. Just like me. Cassie used to be like that, but then something happened. Um, probably. Time to confess. Nate, I... When? I've been looking for you. Where are you going? I'm busy. Maybe we should go and finish our plan? Tyler, you just ruined everything. Nate, don't be sad. I'll just step aside for a moment. <laughs> What's going on? Why are you sitting with Nate? Well, I, um, basically, let's compete in the couples contest. But you didn't want to. According to you, we're not a couple and we can't participate. I'm a girl, after all. I changed my mind. Besides, we can have fun. Let them think we're dating. Wow, that's cool. Let's participate. Don't hug me. We're not really dating. Remember that. Okay, time to continue the contest. Yes, we can start the challenge a bit faster. I should win somewhere. The contest is called Little Kisses. Woo! Mm, but now we'll definitely have fun. Hey, are you planning on kissing someone? I'm your girlfriend. But there's a small catch. You'll remain in the same pairs as in the previous contest. Ugh. Will I be without my little love heart again? And I won't have my little angel. Stop with the lovey dummy stuff. The kisses won't be real. You just have to catch a piece of paper with your lips. This is lame. Why did I agree to these contests? Let's begin! Oh, I totally forgot! We have new participants! Gwen and Tyler! It's their first contest! And they're not switching partners! Let's start! Three, two, one! <laughs> Hooray! Our first contest and already good results! Next up, Casey and Chris! Three, two, one! Ew, you still smell bad. Disgusting. Hey, why are you kissing my girl? I will... What? Uh, no, nothing. Next, Tina and Nate. Oh, I feel sick. Well, that's it. I lost. Then Eva and Zach. No, I can't participate in the contest. My poor little angel. Huh? Well, then, the winners of this contest are Gwen and Tyler. Woohoo! Tyler, we agreed you wouldn't hug me. Why do I have such bad luck? Oh, now I'll be able to catch Nate's attention. Gwen? Uh, why did you change your clothes? Oh, I accidentally got my outfit dirty. <laughs> I think Cassie has a similar outfit. This doesn't concern you. Go away. <laughs> well, princess, let's make up. I'm not a princess. I'm a queen. Forgot? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. And what's this? This is Gwen. Are you crazy? Why are you dressed like me? Oh, right. Um, but it was accidental. There was a sale on these clothes at the store. <laughs> oh, you deceiver. You're copying my style. Nate, hold her. Why? Don't ask unnecessary questions. Quickly grab that little witch. Uh, Cassie, what are you planning? I'll show you. You're insane. Let me go. Let me go. That'll teach you to copy me. Nate, you can let her go. Cassie, is everything okay? Ew, why did you do that? You're annoying me. What was that? Your girlfriend is totally crazy. Gwen, please forgive me. Cassie is just... Dumb. Well, yes, she's impulsive. Sorry again. Uh, stupid Cassie ruined everything. I was almost getting Nate's attention. <laughs> Time to have a snack before the contest. Right, my little darling? Yes, my little bird. I thought I'd never see this moment. <sighs> Hello, do you already know what you'll be ordering? Uh, yes, I'll have a salad with fresh vegetables and a beetroot juice. And I'll have a steak, a huge one. All right, hey, what about the steak? Sunshine, did you forget that we agreed to not eat meat? Huh? Uh, yeah, right, sorry, my little bunny. Uh. We've been vegetarians for a month already, so two fresh salads for us. Tina, I'm losing consciousness from hunger. And anyway, why did we come here? 
We are here to celebrate our lead in the contest. And my exhaustion? Uh, bring me the biggest piece of meat! I'll give this money to charity for bats who lost their homes in a forest fire. Here's your order. Ah, <laughs> uh, meat! Oh, Zach, you're an idiot. You bit me. Uh. Oh, I imagined it. That's it. You ruined my mood. Uh, even our little frog, baby T Zach, can't fix it. <laughs> But now we'll definitely have fun. Yeah, maybe we'll get rid of the competitors. <laughs> What's that smell? The smell of meat? It can't be. <gasps> Chicken! Zach, are you leaving? How long should I wait for you? <gasps> Traitor! That's it. I'm upset. <laughs> My stardust. Wait, it all just happened. I, I... Um, let's not waste time and let's continue our challenges for the couples! I hope we'll go back to our own couples. I mean, I'm mad at my beloved, but I can't do it without him. But no! I'll draw two slips of paper from the box, and whosever names are there will be a couple! So start already to like it this time. <laughs> We'll be paired with... Oh, excuse me. Here's your slip that fell. Nate and Gwen! Oh! Mm, Nate with the girl who's copying me. A couple of losers. Next, Casey and Tyler! Oh, darn. Why her? Shut up. I'm not happy with you either. And next... You know what? I actually want to be with Chris. Yes, he's cool, and I'll only participate with him. What? Are you crazy? <sighs> Ew! Oh, now you'll wash up too. <laughs> Ew, Eva, I'm going to hit you right now. <laughs> down. I need to announce the next pair. Let Tyler and Eva be a couple. I'm scared of her. <laughs> Zach? Looks like we're together. <laughs> my caramel sweetness, my little pastry. With vegan filling. My sweet donuts. Oh, Zach, that's enough. Are you only thinking about food? Time for the contest. <laughs> and what kind of lovey nonsense will it be this time? Honestly, I haven't thought of what challenges to do. So you'll be knocking down bottles with pantyhose. <laughs> what? <laughs> Girls are participating. Whoever knocks down all the bottles faster wins. Tina and Eva, you're up first! Woohoo! Go, Tina! I love you! You're the best! Eva, make sure you don't fart there. <laughs> Shut up! You'll be defeated! Oh. Oh, I'm the first! <laughs> wow! Tina won! Who cares? It's all your fault! I knew I would win, and I want to dedicate this victory to the starving sharks of the Caribbean Sea. The Poor sharks lack meat. Meat. Oh. Ah! oh, it seems it's time to end the contest. I will throw meat. My sweetie, I was so scared. How are you? I still don't know. They said I need to eat more meat. Oh no, that's awful. How can our dream of being vegetarians continue? Well, what can I do? Uh, I brought our little one, t -Zak, to help you recover Faster. What will help me is a huge piece of steak. <laughs> okay, we won't participate in the contest. I'll go tell Miss Christie. Zach! Oh, hey! Kitty! Did you crawl out from under the couch? Yeah, the door for losers. In short, have you already given up your herbivorous ways? Uh, not entirely yet. Oh, when will we start dating properly? I forgot to kiss Zach. Oh, darn. Zach, I wanted to... What's this? Where did the slipstick come from? Did you forget? You kissed me and left a mark. 
This is terracotta with glitter. And I only use eco lipsticks. I color my lips with beetroot. <laughs> Ouch! I was joking. It's a prank. Well, you're such a goofball. I love you, sweetie. <laughs> Zach, I'll give you a couple of days. If you don't break up with Tina, we won't see each other anymore. Got it? Mrs. Christie, come on. You'll definitely like it. Where are you taking me? You'll see in a moment. I still have to host the contest. Mrs. Christie, let's do it this way. You'll do all the procedures in the salon and I'll win the contest. Well, me and my partner, just not Nate. Forget about him. Well, I don't know. Hello, welcome to the most elite salon in town. Is it really that expensive? Of course, a manicure costs $2,000. Wow! Okay, Casey, whatever you said, I agree to everything. Great, then the stylist will do everything and I'll win. Something. Since you've used all the services of our salon, it'll be 100 grand. How much? How much? I thought it would be less. You can pay now. Fine. I'll call my dad. <laughs> I might have to take out a loan. I'll give you until the evening and leave your phone as collateral. Casey, thank you. Now I'm so beautiful. Well, at least I'll win in the couples contest. Who told you that? Our challenges in the couples contest are fair. But we had an agreement, Mrs. Christie. We agreed that you would pay for all the salon services, not that you would win. Oh no, what will I do? <laughs> hey guys, finally, you can get your partners back. <laughs> oh, wow, Chris, did you miss me? <laughs> <laughs> Cassie, we're together again. Ridiculous. I'd rather have stayed playing with Chris. Unlike you, he's a decent guy. Tina and Zach won't participate. And we'll do a couples yoga challenge. You should do this kind of thing. Cassie, just don't get too upset if we lose. I'm just not that flexible. Yeah, right. And I won't be with you at all. Here's our pose. Kiss of the dragon. Oh, you wish! That's my boyfriend! Come here! Oh, I see. Then here's what. Whoa. Hey, are you nuts? Don't you have anyone to kiss? Oh, looks like I've completely made them fight. <laughs> Need to record a video to remember this moment. Uh, now everything is finally over. Nate, are you okay? It's something. I just broke up with Cassie a moment ago. Or rather, she dumped me. Because you didn't want to chase after her like a puppy? Yeah, and because we lost the contest. Oh man, but it was pretty cool. Nate, I think this might not be the right moment, but you need to know. Know what? I like you. Initially, I wanted to ruin the contest because of you, so that you wouldn't become a better couple with Casey. Are you serious right now? And then I decided to participate myself, to be closer to you. Wow, how did I not realize this earlier? If I don't do this, I won't forgive myself. <laughs> Oh, wow. Gwen likes Nate? She just used me, and I loved her. <sighs> <laughs> it's great that I got Casey to pay for all the salon services. I'm so fashionable. <laughs> I'm back on one job first. Get lost. I want to talk to the teacher. Us too. <laughs> The challenges are over! So what? Where's the prize? You didn't announce the winner! Uh, Tina and Zach were disqualified, so we won, Eva! So Listen busy. here! I came up with all this to get you fighting! And to make you stop thinking about love and start studying! 
<laughs> Idiot! You thought I'd really make a normal contest? Dummies! <laughs> wow! How did we fall for that? Yeah, we sure did. What do we do now? First, I need to settle my debt at the salon. I borrowed a hundred thousand from my dad. Uh, is it in your bag? Yeah. <laughs> what are you doing? Eva, hold her. I'm getting the cash. <laughs> Who cares? We grab the bag and run. <laughs> Woo! No. <laughs> what now? I'm left without no money, no boyfriend, and I didn't win the contest. <laughs> uh, kitty, let go. It hurts. Aw, come on! Can't even give a hug anymore? And seriously, take off that hideous hat! <gasps> what? This is baby Tizak, your love talisman! Um, who's that? Oh, darn it, busted! Oh, you jerk! I wanted to tell you the news that the contest is over, and you're cheating on me?! Tina, basically, I've wanted to tell you for a while now that we need to break up. You annoy me. You annoy me too. I'm fed up with this cuteness. Your animal rescues and ecological stunts are unnecessary. Uh, I'll show you stunts right now. Ah! Tina seriously messed up. Darn, now I need to treat my leg. Why did I get myself into all this? But now, no one will interfere with us becoming the best couple. Almost done! There! Oh, darling, I just adore our rich life so much! That's my cupcake! No, mine! <gasps> no! <laughs> These poor folks are so annoying! Get out of there! Quit bothering! Today, we're breaking the rules! We're kicking Liam and Zara oh, out! No! Please! Please don't do it! We, we just don't want to be a couple as ordered! Oh. I want to be with Summer. She doesn't have a partner either. Let her be my girlfriend. Oh, ew! That's really gross! <laughs> Ugh, get this poor guy away from me immediately! Listen up! I decide who dates who here! And you two are going outside the bunker! Oh no, it's really dangerous outside! Please don't kick us out, I beg you! Theo! Come here right now! Mm, yes, Miss Stacy! Theo, take these two out of our bunker immediately! Uh, no! That's how it will be for anyone who just breaks our rules! Got it? Look, if you're kicked out of the bunker, you will sleep forever! Uh, oh no, anything but that! That is why you should be thankful to the great bunker creator! Because thanks to him, you are still alive! We're, We're thankful, thankful to the bunker, to the bunker creator. creator! We're, We're thankful, thankful to the bunker creator! We're 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 thankful to the bunker creator! <sighs> I need to find out what's on this flash drive. <sighs> wow, this is so beautiful. What if they're fooling us and there's real life outside the bunker? Wow, the rich folks floor is so fancy. We could swipe something and no one would notice. Why did they stick us with Nikki on the poor floor? <gasps> are you nuts? What are you doing here? Nothing. I just decided to take a walk and see what you're up to. Oh! Oh! Uh, you slammed my hand! Now I am definitely gonna find out what you're hiding! There's nothing there! Get back! 
Well, then I will tell Miss Stacy that you are hiding something from her. And I'll tell her that you're stealing things from the rich folks. Uh, that's not true. Oops. <sighs> Are you still gonna claim that you didn't steal anything? Fine, then we will not rat on each other. Mmm, how stupid of me to get caught like that. Oh, what a silly. I wonder what else interesting is here. Oh, beans! Wow, so it turns out there's a secret exit in this bunker. It seems like there's no one here. Finally, you're here! <gasps> I'm so tired of hiding our relationship! I don't like arguing in public either. But you know we do not have a choice. Why can't Stacy just pair us up for real? Oh, what if you bribe her and she allows us to be together? I will not even risk it. Do you want to end up like Zara and Liam sleeping forever outside the bunker? No, I don't. Nikki. I'm really mad at you. You're not doing anything for our relationship. Maybe. This diamond pendant can fix the situation? Oh, it's so fabulous. Shh, be quiet so we won't get caught. Oops, it's so heavy. And I also invite you to a romantic dinner at night when everyone else is asleep. You're the best. I really adore you. <laughs> I have to find out what they're hiding from us. I'm sure Miss Stacy keeps all the info in her office. Almost there. Just a bit more. What is he doing here? I have to hack into Miss Stacy's laptop to find out what they're hiding from us. Huh? Oh no, my laptop, dang it! Oh, be careful! Ah! Uh, honey, thank you for saving me. But please do not report me to Miss Stacy. I take it you want to know the truth too. What are you talking about? I believe there's another life outside the bunker, and we need to uncover the truth. Are we a team then? Yes. Oh, he's in a pod! Miss Stacy's coming! We need to hide! I wonder who in the world has guts enough to enter my office! Hmm, strange. I don't even remember having those. Must be my size. Now finally, I can take a 15 minute nap. She fell asleep. Let's go. This is my surprise for you. Wow, Drake, you're so romantic. You both have broken the rules, and you'll face the consequences for it. No. no. I won't give up so easily. Huh? Ah. Uh, catch uh. him! Yes, Miss Stacy. Uh, let go of me. What's happening here? Did you know that Nikki and Drake are dating? What? It seems like you really didn't know. All right, I won't punish you. But you both need to get ready to leave the bunker. No! no! Please don't do this, I'm begging you. Mm, maybe we can make a deal with you? Uh, will this be enough? Hmm. Well, that would be enough. But you have to promise never to talk to Nikki again. I agree. I only need honey. My love, forgive me, I was foolish. Now think about it, and I'll take the watch. 
<laughs> hey, Drake, where are you going? You said you loved me. How can you betray me now? You betrayed me. You're poor and can't do anything. You can't even get me some real decent gift. That's not true. I'll prove it to you. I want to buy a gift for my partner. Yes, choose one. Dang it, everything is so expensive. Oh, I will take the ring. Hmm. Ew, that's disgusting. Fine, take the ring and get out of here. Nikki, this ring is for you. It's pretty, right? I don't need this cheap plastic. I spent my last money on it. Ungrateful. That's it, Nikki. I've had enough of you. Theo, take her to the prison and prepare her for leaving the bunker. No, I'm begging you. Don't get me away. Drake paid you. No. Drake paid for himself. And you, Nikki, are on your own. <laughs> Drake the backstabber. How could he betray me? I hate him. Theo said you called for me. What do you want? Enough with the grudges. Talk to Stacy. Get me out of here. You actually turned me down, even after your betrayal was exposed. Ugh. Fine, just leave then. But I'll tell you something. There's suspicion that there's life outside the bunker. If that's true, give me a sign. Silly goose. You just want to get rid of me and get a new partner. Here comes Drake. <laughs> Nikki? Why are you behind bars? You were supposed to be released, right? I thought so too, but that money was enough only to keep you out. You know, it might be even better if they kick you out. What? Are you a goofball? Your presence has caused me a ton of problems, but my feelings aren't worth this suffering. Get me out now, or I'll tell Justin where you hide your money, and he'll steal everything, and you'll end up on the poor floor. Boom. Oh, I'm in on that. I'm not! All right, I'll figure something else out. Nikki, ready to leave the bunker? <clears throat> Miss Stacy, can I have a moment with you? Leave Nikki in the bunker. I'm begging you. Hmm, you do know how to persuade. But Drake, if I catch you two together again, you'll both be out of here. I really got it. Hmm. You're free to go. Hooray! Thank you! Ah, oh, beans. Now we'll never find out if there's life beyond the bunker. <sighs> I hate this stupid bunker and its dumb rules! Uh, don't worry. I'm sure we will find out the truth soon. I also hate Drake. He's a backstabber and a big liar, faking his love for me all this time. Forget about him. This fool is not worth a cool girl like you. Do you really think I'm cool? Yes, I've gotten to know you better. And it seems I... I understand, but you know we can't be together. Yes, you are right. <clears throat> Honey, look! It's a butterfly! I've read about those in books! <gasps> wow! But how did it get in here? I don't think it could survive in there. Huh? Did you see that? Uh, yes, these are unreal windows. It's a TV screen. Mm -hmm. We have to tell Nikki, Summer, and Drake everything and start a rebellion and find out the whole truth. Yes, let's meet in an hour in your room. No, just let me go. I don't belong on the poor floor. Justin, why did you bring someone to our room? Mm, honey, what are we doing here? I really cannot be near her. And I can't stand being near you. Ew, 
Oh, it smells like poverty here. I'm leaving. No one's going anywhere. Justin and I saw a real live butterfly. What were you doing together with Justin? Ugh, unlike you, we are not a couple. Oh. We think Miss Stacy is fooling us, and there's life beyond these walls. And in the cafe, instead of windows, there are TVs, and we saw them glitching. What nonsense are you talking about? We should be grateful to Miss Stacy for protecting us from a real danger outside. Are you sure it was just that way? We were too young to remember how we really got in here. Oh, uh, well, I believe Miss Stacy, and I'm actually not joining your side. <laughs> Whatever, let her go. We'll handle it ourselves. Let's just start a revolt. Oh, no. I won't agree to this unless it's for a million dollars. <laughs> no problem. <gasps> Limey, I should have asked for two. Ugh. It's too late. But money is not enough. I'm really mad at Drake, and I want him to apologize to me. Get down on your knees. <laughs> Not a chance! Maybe I don't want to participate in the revolt either! Nobody asked you! These will be your apologies for your betrayal! <laughs> it's tickling! All right, Nikki, your conditions are met! Hey, that's not fair! Let's go already! Hmm. Hmm. We, we want, want to know, know the truth! truth. We, we want to know, know the truth! We, we want, want to know, know the truth! truth. Stacy, I told you they were here! Uh, I mean, Miss Stacy. Stop this immediately, I said! No, if you don't tell us the truth, I'll ruin all the paint supplies. Then we'll have nothing left. Hey, what are you doing? We didn't agree to this. Just be quiet, I'm bluffing. Oh, okay. Tell us right away what's beyond the bunker walls. Otherwise, we'll mess up the food. Oh, Miss! Stacy, you don't want to do anything to them? You're all getting on my nerves! Hey! No rebellion! And give me your gadgets immediately! I've had enough of your games! Hey, that's not fair! <sighs> Actually, it's quite fair! Now give me all of it! Fine, take it! Take it! But we'll keep rebelling anyway! Wanna put your gadgets away? Stop all this silliness and come apologize quickly! <laughs> Take it! I said it all! Satisfied? Yes! Let's end this rebellion already! I wanna play games! Come on, pull yourself together and stick with it until the end, or we'll always be tricked! We better sleep in the same room tonight! Poor guy! You're out of luck. I won't let you into my room for anything. Ugh. Justin is right. It's for our safety. Hooray! Tonight we get to sleep on the rich floor. Woohoo! Hey! Do not even think about taking my nice bed! Uh, don't worry. We'll handle it all. Actually, I found a flash drive in Stacy's room with a bunker layout and an emergency exit drawn on it. Why? Didn't you mention that earlier? I don't know, but now without the gadgets, we won't be able to locate him or find out if it was safe. I'll take turns all night. Uh, first Drake, and then every two hours, we'll switch. Can't we just sleep? I'm with Honey on this one. It is the only way to protect ourselves. Hmm, all right. Just you two are acting all super weird. I don't understand what you mean. Um. Could have at least shared some pillows. Enough grumbling. Let's sleep. Oops, I guess that worked. <sighs> I'm awake. I'm awake. <sighs> Who's there? Where are the girls? I don't know. Did you fall asleep? It was your turn. I only slept for a few minutes. Oh no. 
Honey never leaves her credit card unattended. Uh, I'm sure they've been kidnapped. Nikki would never leave her snacks. I have to find Honey and I, Nikki. Has anyone seen Honey? I need any information you've got. Oh, I hate all this noise. Oh, beans, you can't even eat in peace. Uh... The box. It's all mine. Um, did you see Honey? Well, I have got a little something. Oh boy, just spill the beans already. Uh, well, slip me a little cash and I'll give you the scoop. Theo, I will fire you if you keep playing these silly games! Uh, Miss Stacy, I haven't told him anything. I hope so! Now get out of here! Uh, yes, Miss Stacy! It seems like you know where my honey is. I don't know what you're talking about! Friends, brainstorm ideas in the comments about who could have taken the girls. We have to find the thief. Our hope lies with you. I should look for Nikki, but I'm so missing honey. Where is she now? <laughs> huh? uh, Nikki is missing. Have you seen her? Poor thing. Don't even come near me. Huh? It's summer. Have you seen Honey? Uh, aren't you afraid to search for them after the kidnapping? It could be dangerous! We did not say they were kidnapped. Where did you get that information? Uh, well, I saw someone dragging them into the storage room. What? And you didn't say anything? Oh, well, I was so scared! Drake, let's go quickly. We need to find the girls. All right, just don't get too close to me. I'm afraid of catching pornis. It was your decision to search for the girls. Someone's getting kicked out of the bunker for this. <laughs> girls! We finally found you. Uh, are you okay? I was so scared. Hey, what are you doing approaching my girl? Uh, no, we're just friends. Hey, can someone help me, please? Blimey, right. Thank you. Did you see the face of the one who kidnapped you? No, we just woke up here with these hats on our heads. <sighs> Let's get out of here already. It's scary to stay here. Well, I thought I would release the girls when you realized your mistake and came to apologize. What? Summer, did you rat out to Stacy? But why? You broke the rules, and we have to live by them. Yes, and for that, one of you will face consequences! Whose idea was it to start the rebellion? It's not my fault, it's all Honey and Justin! Honey is not to blame. It's all me. <gasps> you will be punished! And you'll be sent outside the bunker! No! <gasps> Don't do this! Do you want a bribe? One, two, three million? Just name the amount! Well… What kind of bribe is that? Can you do that in our bunker? Of course not! Justin is going to prison and preparing for a release! Oh no! Justin, calm down. Everything will be okay. Hmm, who's there? Hello? Who is knocking? What is this silly joke? What is that? Um. Strange, there's no one here. But I need to investigate. Who's there? It's me. You have to apologize to Stacy to stay here in the bunker. No, it's time to find out if there's life outside the bunker. No, I don't want you to go. What if we're wrong and there's no life out there? That's what I'm going to find out, and then I'll signal you. Who are you talking to? The box? Of course not. I was talking to myself. Well, we'll check it right now. No! Weird. He's really talking to himself. Huh. Honey, where are you? <sighs> I barely stayed inside the box to avoid being found. <sighs> We don't have much time left. 
I've always wanted to confess something to you. Oh, Justin. Honey, I like you. And I'm really grateful for the time we've spent together. Justin, it is your turn to leave the bunker now. Go out. All right. The main thing is I got to say the most important words to the person I care about. What are you babbling about? Let's go already. Move on. No, Justin. I have something to tell you too. That's it. Get out of here. I can't believe you're really leaving. <laughs> we will miss you a lot. Although I am actually really glad that there will be one less poor person here. <laughs> I hope you are the next one to be kicked out. Justin, you can't leave now. Miss Stacy, please leave him. Please give me just one reason why I should do that. Because we're in love with each other. What? what? Could it be that my feelings are mutual? <sighs> That's it. Enough! Justin, you need to go! I remember the first time I heard your voice Holding my hand, how could I feel your touch? Cause you were nowhere near No! Justin! If he's out there, I don't want to stay here! Honey, have you lost it? I'm actually your boyfriend! Hey, have you already forgotten how he cheated on Honey with me? And you shut up! I did not ask you! Everyone quiet now! Just follow me! <laughs> Honey, I will let your infatuation slide just this once because there are so few of you left! So does that mean we're off the hook now? I'll do everything to get myself kicked out. <laughs> then I'll come up with a new punishment. I'll lock you up alone in a dark room. I'll make a real fuss in there until you finally let me out to be with Justin. Honey, are you sure you want to be with him? I'm sure it's all because of you. You are to blame for everything. You betrayed us to Stacy. <laughs> <laughs> You're the only ones to blame. With your behavior, I might just end up all alone in this bunker. <laughs> it looks like it's all true. There's no life outside the bunker. So it means we really gotta spend our entire lives here. No, I don't want all of this to be true. <laughs> I want to turn back time. I want Justin to be here. I miss him so much. <laughs> We saw this exact butterfly with Justin. Oh, I'm sure it's Justin sending me a sign that there's life outside the bunker. Oh, I need to tell the others. Why did you drag me back here again? <gasps> Seriously? Why do you always just keep coming back to my poor floor? Just listen, I saw the butterfly again. Oh, that's just a real bunch of poppycock. You're a real noodle brain. Mm, not funny. Justin gave me a sign that there's life outside the bunker. And what do you propose we do about it? Do you want to live your whole life here? Of course not. Then I suggest we leave this bunker and see what happens. I'm in. I actually never planned on sleeping forever. Ah, oh, whatever, I agree. Oh no, I don't like where this plot is going. Keep calm, I won't let them escape. 
<laughs> They're so happy! Let's all do it together just a bit more and we'll open them! Oh, Stacy! Hold them back! We can't let them escape! You three! Get away from the door immediately! Summer, why are you taking orders from Stacy? Who are you, anyway? <laughs> I'm the real owner of the bunker. And you're staying here forever! No! no! Let us out! We want to get out of here! Try as much as you want! We won't <laughs> let you out! <laughs> <laughs> <gasps> Ah! This is the police! Everyone stay in your places! <gasps> Justin! I knew you were alive! Summer, we need to get out of here! Uh, oh no! I will not let you escape! Uh, 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 Stan! Uh, uh, I just can't breathe! Uh. Thank you for the information about the criminals and helping catch them. You are all under arrest. But how did you come back? We saw you lose consciousness on the street. Stacy did a great job creating a montage that was indistinguishable from reality. But why didn't Liam and Zara come back then? Stacy and Summer frightened everyone and threatened to leak embarrassing videos that were secretly recorded in the bunker. Miss Stacy, please forgive us. Don't expel us. We'll be a couple just like you wanted. Mm -hmm. Your banishment will set an example for others. And once outside, don't even think about telling the police anything. Uh, but there's an apocalypse out there. It's all staged! And listen, if you dare tell anyone, I'll upload your embarrassing videos on the internet! We won't tell anyone anything. That's good! Uh -huh. Wow, this place is so cool! Nikki, what if we forget everything that happened between us and just start <gasps> fresh? Get lost! I don't need you! <sighs> And how do you like it here? I'm thrilled. Honey, there is something I didn't ask you. Will you be my girlfriend? <gasps> yes! <laughs> Hold on, why is Summer out here? Uh, Summer has realized her mistake and she won't do it again, right? Yes. I won't get caught by the police anymore. And Justin, you'll pay for bringing the cops here. Now everyone will see your video. No! <laughs> what video? <laughs> <laughs> this isn't funny. Of course it's not funny. <laughs> but it's not over yet. I can easily find new bunker residents. <laughs> Guys, who should I take into my bunker? Share your ideas and comments under the video. Hi, 